been coming for you? a lot of people lately. I mean, once upon a time at three and five, losing to Monday Night Football at home to the Titans, everyone's that's it. That'll it's a wrap. Four wins later, not so much. Not so much. And as the uh, Cowboys take the field, and look, with all due respect to you, Irv, and Emmett and Troy, everybody always looks at the Cowboys. Who's going to be the next triplets? Yeah. Obviously, yeah. there's Dak and Zeke and Amari Cooper. But maybe, just maybe, the Cowboys' identity is on defense. Just, mi- maybe? just maybe these hot boys, yeah. along with Zeke, obviously, with the way that he's running the ball, that's the way you win football games. Certainly when the 2018 NFL is chock full of high-flying offenses that – are scheming their way open or trying to get the matchup problems for you in a defense that could just uh, cut you down. Shut so that's down. why I set you up, sir. That's the way I set you up with a topic bar to boot. And you have no option here. You have no option here to reverse jinx by talking up the opponent like you're Lou Holtz on a good day. Okay? How far can the Cowboys go, Michael Irvin? Well, Rich, and you, and you talk about it. There have been areas and there have been times that they have played super. And, and, and super, I mean, when you watch how they played against the Jaguars, that offense played super. They put up 40 points. You watch what they did against the Saints. That defense played super and holding them to 10 points. So how far can they go? If they can put all of those <coughs> supers together, they can end up in a Super Bowl. <laughs> it's just a matter of playing all of those supers at the same time, and they're doing it at the right time. You want to get better. You want to play well towards the end of the season. Cowboys on a four-game win streak. They can end up with another four-game win streak. That's eight games going right into the playoffs. They'll have a chance to super that thing onto the Super Bowl. I, I think we ought to start the music again, and you should preach to all the teams out there. If you put together your best defense performance and your best offense nice. performance and your best special teams, you can also be super this year or next year. That's what everybody's trying to do. Exactly. I tell you what, for me, I believe they go as far as Dak takes them, and I, I agree with you. The formula is play good defense, run the football, don't turn the ball over. But when you look at this team, eight times they've been under 24 points this year. In those eight games, they're three and five. Very average football team. They're going to have to score points. And Dak is going to have to create more opportunities for this offense down the road, especially when you get into the playoffs and you're playing against the Saints again. You're playing against the Rams, and more than likely, you're traveling to their house to do this. Dak is going to have to monitor, going to have to manage some points for this football team. They're going to have to be in that 30 range. So you can play good defense. You can run the football. They're going to have to win with offense at some point in time, and it's going to go as far as Dak the can take The defense haven't given up 30 points. So I know they haven't. Okay, you're right. The defense don't give up 30, and you get in at 30. Right. You can be super. He's yep. right. And I, 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 you just kind of hit on it there as I set you up here, Steve, is that they're – because of their early season struggles, their record is going to mandate if they do get to the second round of the playoffs, visiting a place like New Orleans, see if they can do it again, but at their house, come out here to Los Angeles. None of those are cold weather sites. They're indoors. Mm. I mean, you bring a running game and you bring a defense, it's entirely possible, Steve. You can't stay otherwise, well, yeah, really. You, you know why they start off kind of slow? Well, they're a young team, guys. The, the triplets that you just mentioned, Dak, Zeke, and Amari Cooper, are youngsters, right? And on their defense, seven starters, guys, are on their first contract. And we've talked about these linebackers before. Leighton Vander Esch, come on! This guy wasn't even a starter when the season started. And Jalen Smith, they're the best pair of linebackers in the league. This is a young football right team that's only going to get better. This is a scary team. Now, I never grew up a Cowboy fan, okay? I always have played against these guys. But they are built to last they're going to make somewhat of a run this year but as they grow up together mike like you did you triplets grew up together and we're together for a decade this is going to be like this new cowboy young team that's going to get better and better and look out yeah the defense no joke obviously the bears can change a lot of this equation starting tonight we should see but uh that's that's the way the nfc is shaping up Mm -hmm. with one month to go